Hey there, this is John from Stormy Studio and this is our new Stupid Pixels game template. I'll just go ahead and show you the gameplay. Start, this is the level select screen, it's very easy to update. Um, this is the play area where you can move the blocks around that are highlighted blue. And this is a bouncing block, that's a standard wall block. Um, put them in position, press the start box and the doors open and the Stupid Pixels drop out. Um, you can change the restitution for the bouncing blocks to decide how much bounce you want to give. Um, and as the pixels make their way back to the end box, the number of saves increases. Let's just press the pause button. Uh, when the pause comes up, it grays the background out. Um, you have a reset button, a home button, and a back button. Let's go for the reset. So that's the bounce. This is a wall button. Um, Let's go! Then open the doors. Uh, if the pixels land on top of one of the wall blocks, they'll carry on in the same direction. If they hit the sides, they'll change direction. I'll show you that on the next level. Um, you can change how many pixels you want spawned in a level and how many you want to save, or you need to save to be able to pass the level. I'm just using some scene attributes. The whole template is set up so um, there's only one unlocked actor in the whole thing, and so that's purely so you can um, set to variables for each level. Everything else is prototypes. Here's the next level. Um, again, got the blocks. Set up the scene. Let's, Let's go. go. The doors open up. Pixels head right this time. Hit the blocks and change direction. You could vary the um, restitution of any of the blocks, the pixels, to change the bounce and the gravity. Um, as you see, as they hit the end box, the number of saves goes up. So go on to the next level. Um, this one I don't think is actually possible to complete, but I'll we'll give it a go. Um, when the pixels come out and they hit these blocks, they'll spin round and stay in their position, almost like a windmill. Um, you get to work out a level design that would work with them, but they're there and I'm sure Let's somehow go. they could be made use of. Ooh, go on. Oh, 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 look at that, even got some home. Perfect. Chaos. Um, but yeah, they're included in the template. For 11 out of 9. Well, these ones have got stuck. But uh, not too shabby. So for a level like this, maybe you could set that you need to save 8 or more pixels to complete it. Okay, let's go home. Show you the fourth level. Let's go! Um, again, I don't know if this one is completable. The basic setup. Let's go. go! Pixels come out, head the right, hit the slope, woo, and die. Let's try that again, quick reset. Um, it's Let's sort go. of a cross between lemmings and bubble ball. Bubble ball. Um, go on! There we go, look at that. Fantastic. Um, and that's the template. I um, hope you like it. The whole thing is very easy to update. You can quickly make your own levels um, and it will come with a text guide for how to update each area, what does what, and there's notes throughout the uh, game salad project file telling you what attributes do what, what behaviours do what. Lovely. Thanks for watching. And uh, please check out my other templates available at www.stormystudio.com.